Hey, welcome back. It's Brad Taylor, a Taylor coach in uh, Milgrove, Ontario, Canada. We're here to shoot a video on one of our 12-footers. Uh, it's a pretty unique unit for people that were tenters that want to get off the ground, want to dry, and don't want the water running through the tent anymore. When they think they picked the best site in the campsite, it's obviously the highest, the most level, and it seems like when the tent's set up and it's raining, the water's always coming through the tent. They're trying to decide what can they do better to get off the ground. I think this is the answer for some of them. So this is a 12-foot. Uh, tip to tip or it's a nine foot floor. One of the differences is that we made it uh, 84 inches wide where traditionally our trailers are uh, 78 inches wide which is 6'6 six, six. so this is seven feet wide and they still have a lot of the great features on the outside so they have the BAL jack so they're not trying to decide how to level it up or anything. If they have a flat where they need a jack, they can change the tire quickly with it as well. Uh, they did put the option of putting a rear awning on the trailer, so it's giving them projection over the door and making it nice and dry. They opted out of the awning on the side, uh, but they have the option that they can add it down the road if they choose to. They'll probably be setting up a dining tent where they choose to set up a dining tent in the park. But as they get down the road, they can always come back and add a side on it. We did put the outside porch light on it, so if they're doing things outside and they want the light along with, along with the back porch lights, so you've got an awning light and a porch light, it gives them lots of light outside also. Let's take you on the inside and I'll show you some of the features on the inside of this particular coach. So up at the front here, what they've gone with is we put our bunk, we put a little knick-knack shelf, and they have their traditional 60, but now this bed is 81 in length because it is 74. So they've got a true queen in here. So if they wanted to take the cushions out of this particular trailer and just put a house mattress in it, that's an option too. The only thing is with a permanent house mattress is that you can't make it up to a dinette if you wanted to sit in, the bugs are bad, it was raining, and you wanted to play games one night or something like that, and you're just kind of chilling out a little bit, trying to get out of the weather into a little better climate. Um, you can see on the back sides here, they've left out the counter, they've left out the bathroom, they've left out the closet, the overhead cupboards, which makes it very, very roomy back here. So now they have the option, being tenters, that they can set their coolers, they could put a portable 110 fridge, uh, maybe a Coolatron, maybe they got a, their, their pets, you know, they're going to be sleeping on the floor and things like that. But they're not worried about where the water is going to be coming through the tent because this has got them off the ground. It's dry. You don't have to about drying your stuff out when you leave the campground. It still has all the great lighting in it. We did put a fantastic fan in it they had asked for. So you got a nice breeze during the night. It's insulated also. So if you want to camp in the cooler weather, they can bring a little portable ceramic heater, plug it in, and do lots of fall or winter camping as well. So it gives them a lot more options in a lot longer season camp where a tent limits you a little bit more for certain people, not all people. Um, and this particular coach, when we put it on, the scales come in at a, a thousand and sixty pounds. It does have electric brakes and that too. Um, so it's got a lot of great features, lots of places for setting stuff, being tenters and things like that. Um, so it's a pretty unique unit all on its own. Uh, I hope you really enjoyed the video. If you got any ideas you want to bring to us, feel free to give us a call. Uh, again, it's Brad Taylor at Taylor Coach. Look forward to talking to you and uh, watch for more videos down the road. Take care. Bye now.